316, take one. Anyone who is brilliant at what they do redefines it in some way, um, instead of aping it. Um, and he was incredibly gifted, but the, within that there's the dichotomy of himself and living with himself and living with that gift and living with the pressure and the media attention and, um, and the uh, addiction. He was a good-looking guy with a nice smile and... You know, he had a, a real natural charm. He wasn't trying to be somebody. He was, I mean, when you see him being interviewed as a young man, you know, he, he's, uh, he's not big-headed in any way, but he just took it on board that he was like a pop star. <laughs> Cheer up, Pop. Could be washed. You could look like her. George has been quite candid about um, the difficulties he's had and the bad times he's had, and he's had tremendous times as well. And certainly one of the, them we were filming today, the celebration of the European Cup final. And both Mary and myself were very conscious of, of trying to make the, this account of his life as rounded as possible, but also not to shirk any of the responsibility of, of showing and what he has freely admitted is, is, is an addiction, I mean, alcoholism, that he has battled with on and off now for many years. Just everybody take a second, just breathe in. Sorry, quiet. Shh. Quiet. Okay, everybody just take a second to rethink where they were, because at the moment, it looks like we're all in line. Get in. But it would probably help if we had the dialogue, because it uh, dictated the... It, it kind of drew us in a bit. There is... It, you know, I'm just saying to do it... A uh, delicacy that come with 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 what she'd bring to it that maybe would not be so testosterone driven and so um cliched i mean she knows more about football than any of us you know you ask her any question she should go on mastermind and you know do the history of man united she she she'd win you know she's incredible see 248 take one and action it is the opinion of this board that, and the world at large that you are not only a great manager, but a truly great man. Yeah. I want to thank each and every one of you for seeing us through, for cheering us home. It's, a, it's, it's full of action, I think, and it's love and... Uh, it's charm and it's um, it's amusing. You can't say it's a knockabout comedy, you know, but it's not. But uh, there is the sort of uh, uh, rake's progress of going down the way, but it comes up again. I would like to be ultimately a celebration of, of this man, ultimately a celebration of the gifts that he has had and has and a celebration of the courage with which he's lived his life, which I think has been misconstrued many times. And I think the fact that he's still here and still honest about what he's gone through and honest about who he is um, is something that we can all learn from. <laughs>